Alright, what's going on guys? It's Natural Kicks and today I'm back with a video. Today's video is going to be more or less of a back to school type video. I know you all have been seeing a lot of these lately, but you know, I hate it as much as you do. But these tips are like pretty much not really school related in any way. I'd like to thank you first, second of all, for the support you guys have given. Really truly blessed and grateful for all of you guys supporting me and um, 300 subs is a lot, and I'm gonna actually do a video once I reach 350 subs on the giveaway. I'm gonna give more details on that. I'm still actually thinking about like what I'm particularly gonna do because giveaways aren't the easiest thing in the world, as some of you may know. This video, I'm actually doing a collab with my great friend Katie Apparel. Her link will be in the description. Let's try to get this video to 25 likes. You guys feel me? Last week we actually got around 20 likes, but. I feel like we can top that because I know you guys are really supportive and all that. Go make sure to subscribe to KD Apparel. Like I said, link is blah blah blah. Also, if you haven't noticed, I actually got braces on. I got them on around yesterday. I might be a little bit under weather today, kind of like low energy. I'm trying my best for you guys because you guys are amazing. I'm like being the most cliche person you can be today on YouTube. KD Apparel is going to be doing a similar video, the three fits and kicks, as well as like the some of the essential pieces and clothing, wardrobe for the upcoming school year. So, without further ado, let's get right into this video. Um, the first fit I'm going to show y'all is actually the fit I'm wearing right now. I think this is really nice because, so for the pants, I'm wearing these Adidas uh, pants that I actually sew sewed myself into like the jogger soccer pants. And for the kicks, I'm wearing the Vans uh, Skate Low, old school. It's like a very essential pair to have for beater and um, you know, it's just, it looks really clean with, and it can go with a lot of different things. And for the shirt, I actually made this shirt myself. Uh, the graphics were already there, the Bruce Lee and the Chinese writing. I actually just added all the white things. So anything that's white on the shirt, I actually added myself with like, transfer paper. I used the transfer paper and I cut out different shapes. I'm actually not really a hype beast, but I really like the things that hype beasts wear. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, and I buy what I like. But I like what high beats wear, so like, I guess that makes me a high beats, but not really at the same time. And having a black and white outfit in your wardrobe is very, it's very good because, you know, you can mix and match with a lot of different things, and it's really trendy right now. So my next outfit is actually this really, really kind of high beats, I guess you would say, um, outfit. First of all, we have the, um, the distressed denim. I think this is really, really clean pants. People wear them a lot, so I think it's really trendy. If you like to be trendy with other people, but I think I really like them personally. I think they just look really clean with a lot of like sneakers. Like I think they look clean with the Air Jordan ones, the threes, you know, etc. Have the flannel, and what's cool about flannels is you can mix and match and layer them as well. And I think that looks really, really clean. I wear them under this jacket that I have. Or in my second video, I think one of my first videos, and it has that jean accent with the what like the fleece as well, kind of like a tech fleece material. What I'm wearing is this custom shirt I made as well with the transfer paper. It's Nature Will Kicks and like a Supreme Box logo. I think this outfit is just really lit and you know the Air Jordan the Air Jordan breads like make it really pop as well. Alright guys so for the final fit we have this kind of more of a professional like more suitable for like a nice like if your school has kind of more of a dress code of like nicer stuff. I got the shirt at Zoomies, another great store to shop at. It's basically kind of has that cool like pattern, almost like a bus seat pattern. I know a few people out of my school like call me, they would like try to sit on me because they thought I was a bus seat. You know, I, I have so many friends, you know. And, you know, it has those khaki joggers which are very like, it, it makes you look a little more professional, know what you're doing. And it has, also we had the Galaxy Customs I did a while back. They kind of go with the whole outfit itself. Alright guys, so last but not least, here are some of the stores I recommend going to if you can go like back to school shopping or something. So number one is H&M. I mentioned H&M a few times I think in the video. They have really, really clean stuff for really good prices. I mean, the only downside in my opinion, to be honest, is that the workers get paid pretty terribly. I mean, you could say that with any company, but you know, uh, I think they're made in Bangladesh. So yeah, that's not a very good place to make the clothing. But if you don't really give a crap, you know, go ahead buy stuff there. I personally like to buy stuff there, but you know, they have really good prices. Alright, so another great place to go back to school shopping is the Nike outlets. If you're looking for some like clean basic shoes for back to school, if you want to use the speeders or something, or gym shoes, you can go to the Nike clearance store or uh, the outlets or whatever. Or even if you know somebody or if you have a pass, you can go to the employee store and 
Oregon. Nike actually has a really lot of clean stuff for to get you fresh and looking good. Another great place is Zara. I haven't personally shopped at Zara, but I know they're pretty much like H&M or uh, Forever 21. Those are also good brands as well to shop at. So if you like that kind of like streetwear feeling, but I high brand to it, but for decent prices, I suggest H&M, Zara, Forever 21. For shoes, here's a really great tip. Check sneaker boutiques on your Google Maps. Find some like nearby you. I'm sure if you live in any main states, like you know, New, New York for sure has plenty of sneaker boutiques, like Cali, uh, even DC has a lot of sneaker boutiques. Go there and get your shoes there because uh, I know a lot of them have some pretty great prices, like one by me, uh, Recess Districts, you live in Seattle, that's 